Hello Leo, it's your girl West Thesis. I'm here today with another collective reading. For personal bookings, you can email me westthesis10 at gmail.com and we'll get into it from there. I'm here today with a love slash general reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. These readings are general, so take it how it resonates. Put your thing down, flip it, and reverse it. This could be for you or the cross roster. So, I pulled two healing messages for you, Leo, and the first healing message that I pulled for you was number 28, which is love. So, Leo, there is someone on your mind, or if someone is on your mind, or you're on their mind, take it how it resonates, but this love card signifies that someone is in some undeniable infatuation with someone else. Someone is obsessing over someone else, someone is in love with someone else, and realizing that they love that person, Leo, with this love card. So someone could be realizing that they love you, or you could be realizing that you love someone else, and it's a hard hit reality. Someone just got hit with a big ass boulder, and their face like a big boulder of love um i feel like leo that whoever that this person could be you have been on and off with this person for quite some time now um you have been wondering if you love this person leo but you haven't realized it until this person was no longer in your sights or you know you were no longer in their sight you know take it how it resonates the next um healing message that i got for you leo was dreams which is number three so Leo, whatever love, whatever infatuation that this is, someone is even dreaming about it. That's how deep that this runs. Leo, with this dream cards, you could be getting significant messages in your dreams regarding someone or someone regarding you, you know? It feels like with this dream card, someone is having peaceful, beautiful dreams, but these dreams are very livid and are very realistic. I feel like, Leo, that in these dreams, it feels like here that you are being tested or tempted in them with a certain person or a certain jewel. That's why I'm hearing a jewel, like jewelry. I'm not, okay, they're saying not jewel. Like someone is a prize here, okay? So, Leo, there is a prize in your dreams. Someone is in your dreams. You're in someone else's dreams. Um, I feel like that whoever that this infatuated man is or woman, this person, they didn't realize that they loved the other individual until um, it wasn't any communication, I'm, I'm guessing. Yeah, thank you, Spirit, yes. They're saying they, Leo, someone didn't realize they loved you until there wasn't any communication or for movement or vice versa. So let's hop into the tarot part of the reading and see what's going on for you. Leo, this is a general slash love reading for Leos collectively. So um, put your thing down, flip it, and reverse it because these readings are general. They could be for you or the cross roster or the shuffle my cards, bless my cards, and bless my reading. So let's hop into it, Leo. Give me energy for Leo, some moon and rising for July. And these readings are in July. They could be past, present, or future. We got the four of pinnacles in reverse coming out. Mm. With the world. So, yeah, someone here lets someone else go. Four of pinnacles with the world. Yeah. Someone here lets someone else go. Yeah, page of pinnacles because someone here wasn't stepping up to the plate. You or them, Leo. You or them. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn coming out. You know, we got, you know, a lot of earth energy out here. Could be dealing with an earth sign. Sagittarius energy as well. Yeah, the King of Cups. And now, Leo, you're feeling this. Yes, King of Cups coming out. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This King of Cups, he could mask his emotions very well. He could be very um, loving towards a certain woman, but won't show her. He could be very angry, but seems loving. He could be very loving, but seems very angry. This King of Cups, he could mask his emotions very well. So, Leo, if this King of Cups is you or another individual, we're just going to say that it's the other individual. Leo, this other individual, they seem as if, you know, it may seem as if that this individual doesn't care, but they do. Yeah, the hermit here. And they're watching you. You see how he's looking through this big telescope? This person, they're watching you. They're watching your every move, Leo. You could be watching this person's every move, you know, with this hermit card trying to figure out where it went wrong and how it could go right. You know, this King of Cups, he's feeling a great deal of pain without someone. Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles, I mean, someone that's single now. Someone that's no longer committed to this Queen, of, this King of Pentacles here. Could be doing with an earth sign, um, Leo. There could be a feminine energy, a queen of pinnacles, some feminine out there. Yeah, four of cups that you tried to give your love to, Leo. They didn't take it. And, you know, it's left you hurt, you know. Take that how it resonates. And there could also be someone out here, Leo, that, you know, had opportunity after, after opportunity to fix the situation with this queen of pinnacles. But it never worked out or never got done. I've seen that as well. Yeah, the lovers in reverse. Someone played with a twin flame energy out here. Someone played with a soulmate's. 
heart you or them leo yeah six of wands in reverse with the two of cups and now someone wants to revive it with this two of cups out here and this two of cups here it looks like that he's crying over that dead flower well the flower really isn't dead but he's trying to revive this situation as you can see in his two of cups energy so yeah someone here played with a relationship someone played someone here played with a twin flame relationship a twin flame energy as if it was a joke as if it wasn't god sent and now since that twin flame has left the building someone here has been sad and heartbroken over it with the six of wands out of here Someone wants to move forward from this heartbreak. Someone wants to move forward from this um, unachievement is what I'm hearing. Yes. So someone here. Yeah, it's making sense now. There is a masculine energy, whether it's you, Leo, or them, that was um, playing with the feminine energy or toying with the feminine, feminine energy or wasn't given the commitment to the feminine energy. So the feminine energy left the building and left the masculine energy feeling sick, which the masculine energy will be this King of Cups here because this feminine energy is no longer here. So this masculine energy can no longer offer to this Queen of Pentacles, whoever that this Queen of Pentacles could be. Could be involved in a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or a Gemini. I'm sensing that with this Six of Wands out here, whoever that you know was the crook here, the one that was the player, Page of Pentacles, the one that didn't want to invest. This person now wants to move forward inside of this commitment that is no longer standing now. Unfortunately, yes, Ace of Cups in Reverse coming out. Mm -hmm. A commitment that is no longer standing, Leo. Someone wants to move forward with you or you want to move forward with them. But the commitment is no longer here. Someone played themselves. That's what that's what this is. Someone played themselves because now this love is taunting you all day, all night. Clear for this world. Yeah, the Knight of Wands in reverse. Someone here impulsively ended a situation with you, Leo. Or you impulsively, impulsively ended a situation with someone else. Yes, King of Wands could have been you. The King of Wands coming out. Queen of, Queen of Swords in reverse coming out. With the Five of Swords. So yeah, Leo, someone here was all talking on no action. Someone turned their back on a chaotic situation. You or them, Queen of Pentacles. No, I'm sorry, Queen of Swords in reverse. It feels like here that whatever feminine energy that this was that turned their back on a situation, they are a hard cookie. <laughs> they are. They're very hard on this situation. They're very um it feels like what this when this person talks, you know, it stings. That's how it feels. Queen of Swords in reverse. Whoever that this person was, Leo, they were done with it you know they were out of there look at this fox is looking he looked like he's in distress and these men are just like not paying attention so Leo, yeah, it feels like here someone was either yelling or saying something to you and you know it feels like that you weren't really paying this person no mind and to this person was like okay you know, now that this person is gone, Leo, you hear this person, whatever this person could have said to you. Maybe this person could have just told you, you know, like, um, I'm not gonna be with you. I don't want to be with you no more because you don't treat me, you know, well, fairly, this, and the third. Whatever that this person could have said to you, Leo, it didn't click into this person was no longer there. It didn't click until you realized that you love this person, Leo, or this person realized that they loved you. So let's clarify for this Four of Pentacles in reverse because someone here did let go. Whether it was you or them, Leo, someone here did let go. Someone here is no longer in a situation. Yeah, Nine of Swords coming out. Someone here, um, Leo, needs consolement or confinement from others. I hope I'm saying that word right. <laughs> they need, um, you know, help from others, consolement from others with this Nine of Swords energy out here. Because it feels like here that whatever situation that this was, Leo, someone had chance after chance. You know, Five of Swords is out here. That's trying shit, trying shit don't work. That's all talk, no action. Someone here, you know, talked the good thing, talked the good game, said that they were going to give a commitment, said that they were um, going to uh, be with this person, said that they wanted to be with this person. So, Leo, let's say that you even said that you wanted to be with this person. You told several people that you wanted to be with this individual, Leo. But it never took place. It never took place. It's like this person that just slipped through your hands. Nine of, nine of um, swords out here. And that's a hard, tough pill to swallow. King of swords in reverse. Because it feels like, Leo, that you are indecisive or this person was indecisive. King of swords in reverse. They couldn't make up their mind about a situation. So with them not making up their, making up their mind or, you know, with them not, you know, making a decision to be with this person or be with this twin flame, the other twin flame left. The twin flame that you were supposed to be with, Leo, is no longer here. 
Yeah, Ten of Cups Reverse coming out. They either you could have chosen their Ten of Cups somewhere else. They could be in a new relationship, you know, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or they're just not with you. You know, they could be out here serial dating, you know. You know, they're just not with you, Leo, or you're just not with them. Take it how it resonates. Yeah, the Empress out here. Someone here, an uh, Empress definitely left the building, Leo. You or them. Someone, someone here left. And with, you know, this Empress leaving, Leo, which I feel like that the Empress in this situation did leave. With this Empress leaving, Leo, this person, they have been taunting you in your dreams, in your sleep, you know, through songs, through text messages, through old memories. You can't get this person out your head or, you know, this person can't get you out through their head. You got the tower out here. Yeah. When this Empress left, it all came crashing down. Now you're living out karmic justice with this tower card and this um, will in reverse. There is some karmic justice taking place, Leo. So let's say, Leo, if this is you. You're the person that's having dreams about this love. You're the person that, you know, is keeping up with this love individual. You're the person that's trying to act like you don't care about this person. And this person left you, Leo. Let's say that this is you. Leo, you are going through a karmic justice thing right now. Three of wands with the four of wands. You know what you need to work on, Leo? And you're going through this right now with this three of wands phase. You're cleaning up your act. Or they are cleaning up their act, Leo. Take it how it resonates. Someone here is cleaning up their act when it comes to a situation or when it comes to a lifestyle. You see how he's like raking up these leaves or whatever? Cleaning up their act to, to get this four of wands here. The four of wands is in reverse. So we know that this twin flame situation is no longer. You two are no longer talking, Leo. You trying to maintain this four of wands to get the upright. And I, I, I can end this reading like that. Three of wands to the four of wands. I can honestly say, Leo, that if this is you, you honestly love this person. You realize that you love this person. So you want to clean up your act for this person and vice versa. If this is the other person, if Leo, if this isn't you, this person, they realize that they love you. They realize that they want to be with you. And so they're trying to clean up their act. And this is, is a good way to end the reading because it feels like here that, you know, someone didn't know that they love someone dearly until that person wasn't there no more. That empress has left the building. And so now this king of wands is trying to get his shit together. So, yes, Leo, that has been your reading. It's your girl, West Tisas. For personal bookings, you can email me, westtisas10 at gmail.com. We can get into it from there. Um, like, share, comment, subscribe. If you're new to my channel, check out my other videos. I have tons that you may like. And if you've been here for, for a while, thank you for being here with me. Like, share, comment, subscribe. I love you lots. It's your girl, West Tisas. Bye.